Okay, today we're going to take out the mandibular left second bicuspid for orthodontic reasons to create some space using the mandibular universal physics forcep. The physics forcep, you can see, has a flat end green bumper area and then a beak area. The bumper will be positioned onto the facial surface of the, in the vestibule as far apically as possible and the beak will engage the lingual surface of the tooth. Now for demonstration here Chin up for me, thank you. Now we're trying to engage the lingual surface of the tooth as much as possible with the beak and the bumper on the facial surface. Now I'm using my left hand here for demonstration and I'm just rotating my wrist ever so slightly. Can we pan out, please? Go ahead. A little bit more. A little bit more. Good. And I'm just using, I'm really holding the forcep with three fingers, uh, um, two fingers and a thumb. And I'm just rotating my wrist downwards. There's no arm strength at all. Now if we can focus back in a little bit. Just rotating very slowly and it could take a minute or two. I'm using my thumb just to kind of hold the beak on the lingual so it doesn't slide off. And you just have to take your time. Tooth is starting to give, starting to give, watch it, watch it, watch it, wow, magic. Let's come back to, so we just took a tooth out that's very long on a mature person with very, very little effort, no arm strength at all simple rotation. The key to success is taking your time. It may take a minute or two using the physics forcep to remove the tooth, but it's as atraumatic as you could possibly get.